running away. Can we prevent it? And if yes, how? Unfortunately, many parents of adolescents who suffer silently from symptoms of undiagnosed psychological disorders, for instance depression, despite living in the same environment, are unaware of their children's isolation and suffering. Even worse, in some cases, parents may actually exhibit indifference, often it being the product of denial. Such examples of negligence, and therefore lack of communication with the child, exacerbate the risk factors for running away. Lacking support and guidance, some neglected adolescents will seek temporary relief from their symptoms, resorting to drugs rather than a medical prescription. As a result, before these adolescents realize it, they're already hooked in drug addiction. So while drug abuse may be a temporary coping mechanism to escape from the harsh reality of their symptoms, it is often not long until they actualize these escapist tendencies by literally running away. And finding a bench to rest is actually a good scenario among all the other bleak outcomes a runaway may encounter. So can the wars be prevented? Yes. How? One, by taking immediate action at school, a social environment wherein some of the early symptoms may manifest. Last I remember, there wasn't a professional at my school to which one could appeal if suffering from a mental health disorder. That's why it is vital that every school should recruit mental health professionals who are able to detect and prevent the early symptoms of a given disorder. It is obvious that the biggest responsibility in detecting and preventing the deterioration of symptoms lies on the parents. Unfortunately, not all of them are equipped with the insight and practices to achieve them. And apart from negligence, abuse tends to be a tragic reality in many households, making runaway even more possible. It may be the case that we may have heard of the cries and agony coming from next door, and we may have remained neutral and silent. So that is why I urge you, if you ever take notice of abuse next door, please do intervene and report it to the authorities. Let's all help these children feel that they don't have to run away in the first place. And even if they ever do, they have us to run back to. Because no matter how far you run away, how much you stray, there will be always a home for you to stay.